Hey y'all, happy Sunday. I just got back from doing a Walmart pickup order. Now we don't live close enough to Walmart to get delivery, unfortunately. So I had to go pick this order up. We do get Kroger delivery out here, but um, about once a month I go to Walmart and pick up some things that we aren't able to get at Kroger. So anyways, this is for a family of five for one week. There isn't any meat in this haul because I already had meat in the deep freezer. So I just kind of bought things that we needed to go with the meat that we already have so that I can make meals this week. So we have a dozen brown eggs here, um, some lemon cake that I got from Publix because the cake that I wanted from Walmart, they substituted and I didn't like the substitution. Um, some coffee, I love this breakfast blend, light roast by Green Mountain. Some uh, mouthwash for my kids. Hand sanitizer, I keep this in my car so that I can sanitize my hands after I go to the gas station. Didn't used to do that before the pandemic, but I do it now. Um, strawberry toaster strudels and Jimmy Dean breakfast sandwiches for the kids' breakfast. Some ice cream to go with the cake that I got. Tonight we're having tacos, so I got some pico de gallo, shredded lettuce, um, these tortilla chips, which were a substitution. They're kind of tiny, but we'll make it work. Um, we've got these tortillas here to go with them too. My husband asked me to get him some chicken fajita meat and peppers and onion because he's going to make um, chicken fajitas to take to work and eat instead of buying food at work. Um, so that's for his lunches for the week. We've got some sour cream here to go with the tacos. This um, celery is for a recipe that I'm making this week. It's a chicken and rice um, like casserole or soup. Um, some sodas for my boys. This is a treat for them. Some little mini Mountain Dews, some mini Pepsis. Got mini Coke for me to put in my refrigerator in my room. I like to have those every once in a while. Just gives you that ah, that you can't get when you're drinking Kool-Aid all the time. I got some whiteout, um, some tape, scotch tape, packaging tape for every time I want to send something back to Amazon and I don't have any tape to tape up the box with. <laughs> Um, some apple straws, cinnamon flavored, some veggie straws, um, crystal light for my boys' water bottles. Um, at school, they like to have these in their water. Some Kool-Aid packets. Uh, Kroger has a much better selection of Kool-Aid, so next week when I get the groceries from Kroger, I will load up on Kool-Aid. My boys ask for a sweet potato pie to go with some Cool Whip we have in the refrigerator. Pizza sauce. Um, this week for lunch, my kids are going to have... Um, pizza Lunchables, like we use the Stone Fire Non Rounds and pizza sauce and shredded cheese to make um, pizza Lunchables. There wasn't any Stone Fire Non Rounds available at Walmart. I went to Publix when I got the cake and they only had caramelized onions, so I didn't get that. Hoping my husband can get some from the Publix by his job for my boys to use for their lunch for this week or it's going to be peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. Um, we got some black and white fudge drizzle popcorn here, some black beans just because we were running low on them. It's a good staple to have. I needed some more cold brew, so got that, 2% milk, the number one consumed fresh fruit in the world, some bananas, and some bacon. And that's about it. This was, oh, I have some peanut butter coming too. For some reason, a jar of Jif peanut butter couldn't be filled at the store that are shipping it. So in total, all of this was about $160. Um, but yeah, that's it. I hope you guys are enjoying your Sunday and I hope you have a great rest of the week. Talk to you guys later.